Former Energy Minister Boachi Jaku, who received 10 votes in the 2008 MPP Congress, is set to return to politics. As a national campaign manager for the 2012 general election, Jaku is part of a competitive field of 10 aspirants for the MPP presidential primaries. The contestants will be narrowed down to five at a special delegates conference. The question remains, what are Jaco's chances in the heated contest? If he hadn't left the government in the manner he did, and after that he's had some issues to pick with the party and indeed the government. In the last poll that we did among MPP delegates, I mean he was the bottom. He and Apraku were swapping positions, the bottom half, I mean the bottom of the of the race, less than one percent. And it reflects his relationship with the party and government machinery. Dr. Fria Koto, who is fifth on the ballot, has extensive political experience, having served as a member of parliament and cabinet minister in the Akufuado led administration. He resigned on January 10, 2023, to focus on his presidential ambition. Although confident about securing a spot in the top five, the question remains whether he can succeed. He is hovering between. Uh, fifth and sixth position. He's a former government appointee and former MP for Padasu. His interaction with them over a period would have enabled him to build some rapport and relationship with them. And they could reward him by putting him among the top five based on his position as a former government appointee himself. The former Minister of Trade and Industry, Dr. Kofi Kunedua Preku, is a prominent presidential contender with a history of disappointment in previous attempts. He believes his economic background and experience in reviving other countries make him the best candidate to lead Ghana out of its current economic challenges. He is somebody we call a serial contester. I don't see his chances as very great. Well, he's been outside the country for a while and even among the MPP delegates, he wasn't pulling at all. But last time we did the poll, he was on zero on 0.3%, less than 0.1%. Aspirants to the NPP flagborough race have diverse experiences and aspirations to shape the party's destiny with their unique trajectory. But who will make it to the top five? The superdelegates will decide.